guys welcome back to another video so today we will be trying out the Laura Mercier Laura Mercier silk cream all free photo edition foundation I have the shade 5c1 nutmeg and it looks like this and I purchased it from Sephora during their VIB sale it's one fluid ounce shape well in the beginning so that's what I'm doing and it's for um, combination all the skin full coverage it has a matte finish and an all free 10 hour wear lasting foundation that remains comfortable on skin which is always a bonus it looks like it has 14 shades so not that many shades I wonder if my shade so my shade is the third from the last so you get an idea of how dark it goes let's go y'all skin is already prepped prime ready to go look I'm shaking this why am I shaking this what is why am I shaking this oh gosh okay so comes in a little squeezy too which is always good I'm gonna try I always say I'm gonna do a little bit in the beginning but we never but so I'm gonna do it like this so it's kind of thick as you can see it's not moving I'm gonna get my favorite new brush from TJ Maxx Russell Russell Ross Marshalls one of those it's called Julep Julep if you can see it whatever that brand is I don't know so let's see y'all don't feel any oil it is matte not drying matte it does feel moisturizing so far y'all I've been doing 100s on these foundations They've been coming together nice. Oh, this looks nice. So this is side is foundation, no foundation. If you can see a difference. It's not thick once you apply it to the skin. It's easy to blend out. gonna take my this is a shop and say sponge to pat this out and it is damp this color is spot on yeah this color is spot on this is my first, this, yeah, this is my first um, Laura Mercier foundation. And this is how much I have left. Of course, you see, I did not need as much as I pumped out. So, yeah. I will do the rest of my face because you know it's the same old deal. So, and I'll be back. Bye, guys. Sits nice, looks nice. So far, so good, but we're going to see. We're going to be the judge of that. So, I'll see you guys in a minute. Bye, guys. Okay, guys, so I am back, and it is now 5.43. So, a little over 10 hours worth of wear. Surprisingly, I did it. I don't want to take it off all day. So as you can see, I'm ollie where I'm normally ollie, not excessively 
Oily. Just a healthy shine. I think it's a really healthy shine. So my powder brush from this morning. So I think it held up rather nicely. Um, it still feels comfortable on my skin. Doesn't feel like I have anything on my skin. It's my pores. It doesn't make my pores look any larger than what they are. And as you can see, with no product on the brush, I just put it on my face and it mattified it again. Something's in my eye. So if you're like a really all the oily person and you tote powder around in your purse or whatever then you probably could blot throughout today the day with it if you feel like you're oily but i just think this looks good and it just looks healthy and it looks normal i'm trying to get away from using really really matte foundations so this was perfect so it did good i'm not mad at it at all so let me know if you have tried it and how it works for you and all that good stuff so, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And of course, I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.